Let's read together. In the heart of a bustling city, hidden behind a facade of modern skyscrapers, lies a forgotten library. Its ancient stone walls, adorned with ivy and moss, whisper tales of centuries past. Few remember its existence, and even fewer dare to venture inside. One rainy afternoon, as the city streets buzzed with activity, a curious wanderer named Arya stumbled upon the library's entrance. Intrigued by the mysterious aura surrounding it, she pushed open the creaky wooden door and stepped into a world frozen in time. Inside, the air was thick with the scent of old books and secrets long kept. Dust danced in the dim light, filtering through stained glass windows, illuminating rows upon rows of shelves laden with ancient tomes. As Arya roamed the aisles, her fingers trailing over the spines of forgotten classics, she felt a sense of wonder and excitement, unlike anything she had ever experienced. Each book seemed to hold a story waiting to be told, a world waiting to be explored. Lost in her reverie, Arya failed to notice the figure watching her from the shadows. A soft rustle of robes, the library's guardian emerged, a wise old librarian with twinkling eyes and a knowing smile. Welcome, dear traveler, the librarian greeted Arya, his voice a gentle echo in the hushed silence. You have stumbled upon a place of magic and mystery, a sanctuary for seekers of knowledge and dreamers of dreams. Intrigued by the librarian's words, Arya listened as he recounted tales of forgotten lands and lost civilizations, weaving a tapestry of wonder and imagination with each word spoken. Together, they journeyed through the pages of history and legend, uncovering hidden truths and untold secrets. As the hours passed and the sky outside grew dark, Arya realized that she had found more than just a library. She had found a home for her restless soul, a haven where her imagination could soar free. And so, with a heart full of gratitude and a mind full of stories, Arya bid farewell to the forgotten library, knowing that its doors would always be open to those who dared to dream. Sure to check out my other incredible tales. Goodbye.